In affected joints, the cartilage, normally a smooth protective layer that prevents bones rubbing together, becomes worn and thin. The lubricating fluid inside the joint, otherwise known as synovial fluid, is also affected as the level of its lubricating ingredients declines. In response to these changes, the body produces inflammation, which contributes to the joint's stiffness and pain felt by the patient. So now you know what happens to a joint affected by osteoarthritis, I can tell you how Flexisec provides relief from those debilitating symptoms. Flexisec comes as a gel and is simply applied to the affected joint and left to dry. All rather simple so far, but as the gel dries the exciting science we call sacrosome technology begins to work. Packed inside the gel are millions of microscopic spheres called sacrosome vesicles. Each sacrosome is constructed mostly from naturally occurring molecules called phospholipids and is engineered to be super flexible and highly attracted to water. The water-based gel, therefore, provides a perfect environment for them to occupy. As the gel dries up, however, a sacrosome is no longer comfortable and looks for the closest source of water inside the skin. The vesicle's tiny size and super flexibility allow it to elongate and squeeze between the skin cells as it begins its journey to the joint. Don't forget there are millions of sacrosome vesicles in one application of FlexiSec and this large number entering the skin pushes the first wave of vesicles deeper through the underlying tissues such as fat. After travelling through various tissues, sacrosome vesicles arrive at the joint capsule and complete the first stage of their journey. As the synovial fluid circulates around the joint and the joint surfaces press against each other, layers of vesicles are deposited all over the cartilage, building up over time and multiple applications. Sequisome vesicles effectively supplement the important lubricating layer of phospholipids, otherwise found on healthy cartilage, and restock the levels floating around the synovial fluid.